the formula for Young's modulus is stress upon strain okay let us see the dimensions of the stress and strain separately then we'll substitute here first let us see for stress stress is equal to formula force upon area now write the formula for force force is equal to mass into acceleration and for area length into breadth now write the SI unit for each of the terms for, for mass kilogram for acceleration meter per second square so m into s to the power of minus 2 for length meter and for breadth meter here meter meter will get cancelled the remaining terms are kg here meter is there by writing on the numerator it will be m power minus 1 here it is already s to the power of minus 2 now express the dimension of formula kg is expressed in terms of cap capital M and meter is expressed in terms of capital L power minus 1 is there so L power minus 1 here second is there and second is expressed in terms of capital T power minus 2 so T power minus 2 should be enclosed in square brackets this is the dimension of formula for stress again we have to find the formula for strain strain is equal to formula change in dimensions change in dimension to the original dimension for example i am taking as a length as an example so change in dimension change is expressed by using a greek letter delta length l and original length i am taking an example capital l so change in length on upon original length si unit for the length is meter and for length is also meter both will get cancelled and the remaining is one that means strain is a dimensionless quantity to express the dimensions of the strain we will write m power 0 l power 0 and t power 0 this is the dimension of formula for strain now substitute these two formulas here in this equation we will get m l power minus 1 and t power minus 2 and here strain is a dimensionless quantity so i am writing as 1 so m l power minus 1 t power minus 2 is the dimensional formula for Young's modulus i hope you like the video please do like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video